up to okay. my subscriber. Sure. Hi, I'm Kate. <laughs> I'm born and raised in Victoria, BC. Mm. Um, and I met Owen at UVic. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna ask you five questions. The first one is, how many Korean people do you know in Victoria? Um, it's not that difficult question. No. I guess. Yeah. So mm. I know four yeah. Korean people in yeah. Victoria, yeah. Um, including me, including you, yeah. including your wife, yeah. and including Hyun, oh, yeah. <laughs> your baby, oh, yeah. and one other person oh, from Korea yeah. in Victoria. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, have you learned about Korean language? Like, have I learned about it? Yeah. Have you tried? Or? Uh, like yeah. a little bit, yeah. but then I stopped trying. <laughs> So yeah. I found myself like wanting yeah. to learn more about Korean culture, yeah. but the language is really hard for me. So. Oh yeah, I yeah. Uh, as far as I know, BTS, <laughs> who are Korean singer, they are really popular in the world as a singer. What, uh, what I wanna ask you is that, do you know them? Yes. How I do you think about like BTS? How do you know the BTS? So I know about BTS because they were on the Jimmy Fallon show. Yeah. Just recently, yeah. I downloaded their okay. last album yeah. to listen to, and I think I like it. Yeah. What yeah. I what are you gonna ask you about the BTS? Yes. Because I ask many people who are Canadian. <laughs> I thought that BTS is really popular in the world, but. Yeah. They don't know oh. like BTS, so that's why I ask you. Yeah, I've heard about them. They mm. dance yeah. so good. How to advise of them who wanna like make a foreigner friends? Mm -hmm. in, uh, in, in Victoria especially? Yeah, I think mm. like the way that I've met mm. foreign friends mm. or the way that I would suggest making foreign friends mm. is if you have a little bit of time is to find something to volunteer with. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. So I find that that's a really good way because you find something that you're interested in. So I was really interested in soccer. Yeah. So I decided to volunteer with Special Olympics soccer. Oh, yeah. And yeah. I met a whole bunch of people that I helped with the soccer, but all of the other coaches were also yeah. volunteers. Yeah. And so I met like other Canadians, oh. I met people from Sweden, oh. I met people from Brazil, yeah. and it was just really neat because we all really loved soccer and mm. we lived, really loved people, mm. and so it gave us an opportunity to like meet other people and then also to give back to the community and yeah. learn more about the people in the community. Uh, I think yeah. like any time mm. someone's speaking in another language mm. that the fear mm. Of speaking in another language or the lack of confidence mm. is the hardest part mm. just continue to try mm. then I think most people in mm. Canada understand so what is that good way to improve mm. like English skill as quick as possible living in the place mm. working volunteering mm. and just like so try to try to do as it. much as you can mm. in that language like watch the news in mm. that language mm. or like read in that uh, language yeah. so i think you're doing all the right things like you read harry potter yeah. you work in english yeah. you make friends yeah. you're always trying to talk in english yeah. it's i think it's the right way to do oh, it okay. so good job <laughs> thank you so much my last question yes many people might not know about victoria mm. because victoria is a small city mm -hmm. i think they know about like Vancouver, but they don't know Victoria very well. Could you explain a little bit about like Victoria? Oh, explain like, about, yeah. oh yeah, oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> um, I feel like yeah. it's kind of like on the edge of the world, yeah. like it's on the most west coast you can be. And in the city, it's really pretty um, because it's smaller, but the harbor, yeah. so it's surrounded by ocean. Yeah but it's really close to lots of trees and mm. lots of mountains. Mm. And I think the people are really friendly and there's lots of things to come and look at. Mm. So I think we have a good museum. Oh. I think we have Butchart Gardens, which yes, is but beautiful. And yeah. lots of people know the Butchart Gardens. I, I've never been yeah. to Butchart Gardens yet. <laughs> and there's ocean everywhere. Yeah. And the food is really good. It's like goje. It's like goje. <laughs> what do you think about some people who want to travel in Victoria? Which mm. season is like best or best mm. to travel in Victoria? I think it's summer, I, in my opinion. Summer is so popular because yeah. then it is, it's warmer. Yeah. So it's nice for people who come from warmer places mm. or from colder places. Yeah. My favorite is May. Oh, I May. love May in mm. Victoria. Why especially in May? 
I think it's when the temperature is sort of warmer and oh, like in May. Not too cold, not too hot. Yeah, and the birds sing louder oh, in May. Like mm. April and May, like right mm. as it starts getting dark, the mm. birds sing the most beautiful songs. I don't know. I just, I love that. Awesome. Come to Victoria. <laughs> so I think it's done by question.